Hi there, welcome to our channel. Honor's V series devices offer top tier performance and are complemented by powerful cameras with small compromises, but with an impressive cost reduction compared to Huawei phones. Now, Honor is expected to launch the successor to the premium V30 series. Until now, we have had some rumors and leaks, but most important one and the most recent one is about the processor. And this leak was brought to us by the Chinese leaker Digital Chat Station. He says that the Honor V40 series will not use the Kirin 9000 chipsets. You might know that Huawei sold the Honor brand just this past week. Before that, it was rumored that the Honor V40 series to be powered by Kirin 9000 chipsets. And now that they are separated, it looks like they will not share the processor after all. Actually, Huawei wouldn't mind sharing the chipsets, but the company has trouble sourcing those chips as the US-China trade war has blocked TSMC from fabbing chips for Huawei. It did produce a few million units, but those are probably all reserved for Huawei's Mate 40 flagships and the upcoming P50 series. So long story short, Honor couldn't use the Kirin 9000 chipsets even if they wanted to. So what will Honor use instead of Kirin 9000 chipsets? Some suggest that Honor will go for MediaTek's Dimensity 1000 Plus chipset. It's a 6 nanometer chip with a powerful performance in the range of Snapdragon 865. But still, there are rumors that the Honor V40 Pro Plus, the top-end model, will get Kirin 9000 chipset. Let's see what happens. Aside from that, the Honor V40 is being expected to have a 6.72-inch Full HD Plus display with either 90 or 120Hz refresh rate. And who knows, this might be an OLED display and likely the first in Honor line. The other high-end models, V40 Pro and V40 Pro Plus are said to have the Sony IMX700 RYYB Pixel Arranged Primary Camera, as well as offering support for ultra-fast charging at 66W wired charging alongside 40W wireless charging. There will also be stereo speakers, 5G and glass build. As for the pricing, nothing is known yet. The V40 series was also supposed to launch with Harmony OS. We wonder if the split is just towards the hardware or software as well. By the way, Huawei is scheduling to launch the first Harmony OS beta for developers on December 18th, while the public beta will be out by April. The first demo units running the OS will arrive in January or February 2021. About the launch of phone, rumors from Weibo cite a mid-December launch for at least two Honor V40 series handsets this year. So that is all for today, catch you in the next one, peace out.